Hello and welcome back to part 8 of how to convert a tub shower to a walk-in shower. I'm How To Bob and today is grout day. So I'm going to start out by wiping down all the walls, making sure that I wipe off all the mortar that spilled out around the joints. I'll use an old towel or a sponge, whatever I need to get the old mortar off. Once I'm done with that, I'm going to vacuum out the grout lines to make sure that any loose debris that's down in there doesn't interfere with my grout once I get ready to put that in. So once I get all this loose debris vacuumed out of the grout joints here, I can go ahead and mix up my grout. And once I get my grout mixed to a nice smooth consistency, I'm going to start on the walls and I take my grout and I go diagonal with my grout float just to keep from pushing grout out of the joints. I want to kind of push it into the joints and once I get all my joints done I just take a clean sponge and wipe down all the joints and just keep going over it. Let it dry for a few minutes and then go over it once again so that the uh, grout does not haze over on the, the tiles. Then I'm going to go down to the floor of the shower pan and this takes up quite a bit of grout because of all these rocks and things and I just put go at different angles with my grout float and work it into the corners real good. Make sure I fill in all the cracks and crevices. And then I wipe it down with a nice clean sponge and I repeat the whole process for the entire bathroom floor. So that's part eight. Check back again for part nine. I'm How To Bob. Thanks for watching.